I like to disappear for two years, go to one area and, and try to capture the essence of that place. And I always wanted to capture night photography in the Kalahari because it hasn't been really done before. I was actually following a leopard called Luna. She wasn't always available. So when we can't find her at night, then we obviously move on to some other species. And lions can be very entertaining. Lions, they like to sort of show off, you know, especially cubs. Every time you stop there, they run, all six of them run towards the vehicle as if they want to come and say, how's it? And that's what sort of gave us the idea to mount some of the camera equipment alongside the vehicle at low levels. Or I knew that this particular pride was in the area. They had a kill, which means they're going to drink. So you can sort of plan, let's try to do something there with some remote photography. But it worked out very well. You walked straight into the camera and it was the moment that I wanted. Yeah. So. The Wildlife Photographer of the Year Awards is the Oscars of wildlife photography. It gives the people opportunities that hasn't got, you know, they're not as fortunate as us be surrounded by all these wildlife and these amazing places that we can actually go. The Wildlife Photographer of the Year brings it to the people that can't be part of this, that they can be part of the exhibition.